looks like I'm gonna start assembling the wheels so that we can get ready to mount the tires and get them balanced and get them on the car. Good morning. So the plan was to always get the windows tinted on the Mustang and we realized that before we go and we put the roll cage in, it would be a whole lot easier uh, for the windows to get tinted with it out and the entire interior out. So we called up our friends over at Imagine Audio. They sent someone over real quick this morning um, and they went and they tinted it. So we got 35% all the way around all four side windows and the back window, all 35%. Now, we have to send the wheels to get the tires mounted and balanced on there. So uh, before we can do that, we have to put the wheels back together. So that's what we're gonna go ahead and do now. So what I'll do is I'll place a couple bolts and then we'll start putting Loctite on them and get them tightened up. All right, we got all four done. Let's go get the tires on. While we're waiting for the tires to get mounted and balanced, we're gonna take a look at the new aftermarket axles we have in order to swap them out with the factory ones. We're also gonna take a look at the suspension. We're gonna put a coilover. Uh, we're gonna put a coilover kit in it. different about these ones? They're stronger. These axles are rated for 800 horsepower. The ones that are in the car are rated for about 500 horsepower. <laughs> Slamming stuff already. The extreme adjustable cool it over. Woo! Fancy. Look at this. Look at this. Two inches. Some rear springs. start by putting the car back up in the air, take a look and see if we're gonna do the axles first, if we're gonna do the suspension, all at the same time. Not quite sure yet, we'll see what's the best plan of action. I'm gonna start taking off this axle nut, and then I'm gonna undo a couple of these different control arm bolts in order to be able to move the knuckle out of the way. We'll, un, um, we'll disconnect the axle from the knuckle, and then when that's all free, we'll go ahead and take it out of the rear differential. It's actually pretty free.
one axle. the next one. Axles are in. Let's start hitting up this rear suspension. That's an easy shock. the other side. I don't know what you think, but that was a lot easier in my opinion. back 
back up now. Back is done for now. Uh, let's move to the front and see what we got to do. And in Link is history. I can see why they give you different ones. So, this is left side, this is left side. Let's see what we get. That one's done. Let's go check the other side. There we go. Ready?
all the suspension's on. Now we can put the brakes together and get this thing back on the ground. Lay down some cloth so we don't scratch the caliper. Right? I'm laying down some cloth so we don't scratch the, the powder coat. And we're gonna start with the front, get them assembled, and move on to the back. Try not. Now I got the last caliber on, let's lower the car down. I'll bleed the brakes, bleed the clutch line, get the wheels on and get it down onto the ground. We're just gravity bleeding it right now to get started. Get in there and step on the brake for me, please. You open the door. What am I supposed to sit on? Which one's the brake? Yeah, that one. Ready? Yeah. Press it all the way to the floor? Yeah. Press. Oh. Bump it up. Okay. All right. Let's uh, look into what we have to do for the clutch. What are you doing? Bleeding out the clutch line. How many times you guys do that? Uh, I saw sources about 100. You gotta start with your hand, and then when it relieves uh, spring pressure, then you can use your foot. All right, I think we'll go with the clutch. Let's um, get the wheels, put the wheels on, we'll get it on the ground, and check ride height.
We got the drivetrain all back together. We got the powder coated brakes on the car and the new wheels. All the colors look really good. Um, we bled the brakes and the clutch. So the next thing is to put the roll cage and the interior back at the car. Hopefully after that, we can try and get this car started, see how she runs. And uh, if you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We don't want you to miss out on any of the action and we'll see you on the next one.